Hey there, YouTube. Welcome to Monday's edition of The Breakfast Club. I'm Got That Funk. Thank you for joining me. A few announcements I want to make for this video. First of all, though, the pleasantries. I hope you all had a great holiday celebration. I know I did. Um, I'm still paying for it with my head meets, but that's my problem. Anyway, we're around about 800 subscribers now on The Breakfast Club channel, and I want to thank you all for hitting that subscription button. Um, there's a few things that a lot of you won't know already, though, because uh, not everybody who is subscribed has watched the original inauguration video of The Breakfast Club. And those of you who did watch it will already know some of what I'm about to say, so I apologize for repeating myself, but I want to make sure that everybody out there has a chance to be sort of clued in as to what's going on in The Breakfast Club so you're not confused. First of all, we have a different contributor every day of the week, and that's the whole idea behind The Breakfast Club. Unfortunately, sometimes people will be dropping out of being hosts. Um, if the old Breakfast Club channel is anything to go by, I think we can expect to lose one or two people every couple of months. That being the case, I'm always on the lookout for people who'd like to be contributors on the Breakfast Club, including guest contributors. Now, I've got what I call a parachute list, you see, because if one of the Breakfast Clubbers can't make their video on a particular day, as long as that host lets me know a couple of days in advance that they won't be able to contribute that week, I can get somebody off of my parachute list and parachute them into the slot so that uh, the Breakfast Club channel has content every single day of the week, which is the goal. So if you'd like to be on that parachute list, if you make videos yourself and you'd like to be a member of the club, all you've got to do is follow me on Twitter, tweet me a message uh, saying, you know, Paul, follow me back and then I'll follow you back and we can have a private conversation and messages on Twitter about it. And there's no guarantee as, to, as, as or when I might ask you to be a Breakfast Club host um, because it totally depends on when someone can't do their slot. Okay, so impatience is not something that should be part of your character if uh, you want to be on the parachute list and you're keen to get on the Breakfast Club. However, getting on the parachute list is probably the best first step to becoming a regular contributor on the Breakfast Club, as I'm about to describe to you. You see, we lost our Wednesday contributor, which was Jacob Truman. I was particularly um, sad to see Jacob go, but not at all surprised because when he first agreed to be a Breakfast Club contributor, he did warn me that he might be unable to keep it up because he has so many demands on his time. Unfortunately, that's what's happened. He's got several projects on the go here on YouTube, as well as you know a, a very busy social life in the meat world, and he just couldn't keep up with his content. So this past Wednesday just gone, we had our first guest con contribution, and that was from Noel Plum 99 Jim's a longtime friend and associate of mine on YouTube, and I'm absolutely confident that he will be making more guest appearances on the, the Breakfast Club as time goes on. But Jim also couldn't commit to being our regular host for Wednesdays. So next up on Wednesday on the Breakfast Club will be D. Landon Cole. He prefers to be called Landon. Uh, Landon and I have been acquainted here on YouTube since early 2010. And he is one of the most intelligent YouTubers I've ever met. He's particularly astute as regards politics. And I'm absolutely sure that his contributions on The Breakfast Club will be both interesting and entertaining. So he'll be the new host after JJ Talks this week and from now on on The Breakfast Club. So that's the parachute list out of the way. That's the new host out of the way. I've only got one more thing I've got to tell you about. See, if you didn't watch the inauguration video, you won't know this, so here's what's going to happen. Starting next week on Monday, I'm going to introduce a topic that is going to be discussed by all six of the other hosts on The Breakfast Club. The following Monday, I'll do my response video to all of their responses. And after that, it'll be JJ Talks, who's the Tuesday host on The Breakfast Club, to introduce a topic. Then all six of us will discuss her topic, and then the following Tuesday, she'll do a rebuttal to our responses. Every Breakfast Clubber will take it in turn. After her, it'll be Landon. After Landon, it'll be Bionic Dance. After Bionic Dance, it'll be Sketchy White Dude. After Sketchy, it'll be ZZZ Giant Awake. And after him, it'll be The Peach. Now, there's seven hosts, and each cycle takes eight days. So that's eight weeks in total, which will bring us up to the end of February. Now, we're only going to do this as a sort of experiment. We're going to see how the audience likes the format, and we're also going to test out how the contributors like the format. Now, if the contributors love it, but the audience hates it, we'll probably ditch it. If the audience loves it, but the contributors hate it, that'll be an interesting conversation. But in the meantime, let's just try it out, okay? So starting next Monday, I'm going to be introducing a topic um, 
which all of the other hosts will discuss in turn. Now I've already got my topic picked out and the reason I picked the particular topic that I picked is because I know for a 100% certain fact that all six of the other contributors have vastly different opinions on this particular topic. So I should think it'll make for some interesting conversation. But for now, until the end of the year, each Breakfast Clubber will still be talking about whatever they want to talk about on their particular day. After New Year's, we're going to do that two month long cycle. Then after that, we'll have a discussion, figure out if we want to keep doing it or if we want to just do it once or twice a year, that kind of thing, or ditch it completely and never go back there again. Part of it's up to you and the audience and the rest of it's up to us. I look forward to finding out how it all works out. And I want to thank you all for watching this video. Up next on The Breakfast Club is JJ Talks. And uh, I have no idea what she's going to be bringing up in her video, but I look forward to seeing it. And I look forward to having you back here next Monday on The Breakfast Club. Thanks for watching, and may all your ups and downs be ups.